Hi everybody. Hmm. I've been trying to download an architectural desktop today, and actually I tried before, and then my teacher had actually at one point said, "Download it to your eight gigabyte flash drive, and um, then you know do it with it while I'm here." But that doesn't work. It will not download to a flash drive, even if you have eight gigabyte in it. It's not going to do it. And I learned that the hard way. Anyway, so I decided to chuck it all and just download it to my laptop. You know, without having the flash drive in. Well, the flash drive sent in, but I didn't do, use the flash drive to get it downloaded. And in the meantime, it was taking so long to download, I decided I'm going to go to the store. And the original intention was for food. It was going to go to the grocery store. Then I got in the room and thought, well, I could go to Office Max and check out, see if they have architectural desktop. They don't. Oh, but anyway, but when I got to Office Max, right next to it is Circuit City. You know, Circuit City is going out of business. There's two days left. And I said, well, I'm just going to go in there and look to see what they call. Got. And so while I was in there, my boyfriend Joe was called. You know, Joe loves, knows how I love cameras. Yeah, I love cameras. And so I was talking on the phone, telling them what I was doing, just looking off the back to see what they have because they're going out of business. And um, so I tell them that I'm going to see if they got any cameras. No cameras. Oh, but camcorders, yes. They had three of them. And one of them was one that would have been like $400, but it was on sale for 132 Nice. Mm-hmm. I did. He threatened, Joe threatened to get his strap out. Don't tell my mom, please. Oh, I will never hear the end of it. Anyway, yes, I spent $132 on this. Mm hmm It's a display model, and it did not have the battery or any of the other accessories. So I'm going to have to learn how to use all the buttons on here. All those buttons there. It's a 42X optical zoom. So if anybody out there has one of these and they know how to operate it and got any helpful suggestions, let me know. Uh, because as soon as I get the batteries and get this thing working, I'm going to be playing with this. Your boy. I've already figured a few things out how to turn that on. And off. Anyway, okay, so this, I've already got an SD card put in it, so I'm not going to worry about software for the computer because the SD card will, you know, bring it up on this. My car, my computer has a little slot for SD cards on it, which is cool because it's an Acer, my computer. And I also got something else from Walmart when I went to get the SD card. This is something I've been wanting. And, well, I didn't know they had them this cheap or this easy. But anyway, this is a film and slide digital converter. It will take your film strip from your old from your camera that does film and makes it into a digital thing. So if you got old film strips around from years and years ago, you can convert them. Plus, I have a film camera, you know, that does black and white photography. So I can use that to make some really wonderful pictures and convert them. Yep, yeah, if I need to. Mm -hmm. And I plan on it. And I plan on playing. Now I suppose I have to get back to my um, architectural desktop program now that I've got it on my laptop and get to work with my CAD project. And I'm going to have to, can't probably end up having to uh, drop the Photography 2 class due to time restraints according to the project class because I have lots of work to do but now that I got the architectural desktop program on my computer I can do that anywhere I can be working on it at mom's house I can be working on it when I'm in Durham yeah, yeah. anyway all right say bye now so please y'all tips suggestions I'm going on eBay and I'm going to the Panasonic site, and I'm going to look for accessories for this thing because well, I need it to work. Bye now.